This is our PBL cereal box optimization. So every day we eat cereal. It's a common household object. Food, yummy, delicious, packaged, easy to eat as a breakfast meal or as a late night snack whenever you're feeling like it. But what about its packaging? Have we ever thought of about that? One day I managed to trip over a box and it led me to my current project idea with my partner Cereal box optimization. Why is the cereal box the way it's shaped it is? Me and my partner thought it was quite strange, so we decided to measure the volume and find the volume of a regular cereal box and see if any other shape could minimize the amount of material used to create the box of the same volume. So we used Lagrange's optimization multiplication theorem, and so we calculated how we could find the, the optimal sur surface area. After using optimization, we realized that there is an optimal surface area that's less than the standard cereal box size based off what we found on our results. So in the next image, you'll see our results. So there's our volume that we calculated originally and we found the optimal dimensions and surface area for that volume. Thank you for watching and if you have any more questions about our PBL, please visit our website.